All right, everybody, my name is Anthony Salvatore. I work at Frac Pro, and today I'm going to show you how to create a multiple wellbore file for use with zipper operations. So what you're going to do to start is first step is to create the IMP files. You're going to have one for each well. In this case, I have two for a two well pad. If you have more than two, that's fine. You're just going to need to have one for each well, as previously stated. So we're going to open up that file by double clicking it and it'll be open here um, once it's open the for, for your first well you're going to go to file and under file there's this select well multiple wellboard files button we're going to click that and it's going to bring up the select wellboard screen and as you can see we already have one well connected so and that's the well name there we're going to hit add it'll bring up a browser search window and you're going to select the second well and it'll add it in there um, I'm also running a multi-stage file, so multi-well, multiple-well, multi multiple-well, multiple-stage file. And the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a job sequence. The next thing I'm going to do is create a job sequence. So I'm going to hit job sequence there. Use this well bores, um, and you can do this one or two ways. You can you can select the well, and then each treatment, if they're alternating in a in a different order, or we can use this set alternate button and select the wells that are in order of each other and then hit OK and it'll auto populate each of the stages. So well one, stage one, well two, stage one, and so forth down the line. If we are fine with that, go ahead and hit OK. Next, we're going to hit continue and we're going to be prompted to save our new multiple well, well bore input file into a master file. Hit OK. And it's going to default to the pad name that's on, on F3. So if that's blank, you're going to have to type it out. If you want to name it something different, you can, you can do that here. I'm fine with this name, so I'm going to hit save. And now I've created my multiple wellbore file. That'll bring me to simulation control. And I'm just going to swap my time step to 1. File save, and there you go. Now you can operate each wellbore with uh, individually from the same file without having to open and close separate files. So if, for instance, I'm on stage one or well one stage one, and I, I monitor my frac job, and then I want to go to well two stage one, I would just hit that, and there we go. Thanks for listening. Be sure to comment or send us an email if you have any questions or issues.